All right, guys, what we're going to do is uh, uh, DEF CON's always played spot the Fed, right? How many of you have spotted a Fed before? None of you. Okay. You're all fucking lying. <laughs> what the fuck are we doing up here? You know? Anyway, okay, here comes Priest. What we're going to do is Priest is going to pick on, or not, pick out what he looks, what looks like a lamer. And we're going to play spot the lamer, and you guys in the audience are going to determine who the lamer is. So, Priest, please, uh, you know, pick out some. Uh, I apologize, I got stuck in traffic. Uh, a couple announcements real quick first. Anybody here from the FBI? Raise your hand high, please. <laughs> He's not here to arrest you. It's well said, Rumor. Okay, they're not going to do that. He's here to have a call. So don't mob it. Number two, we apologize. We are trying some new things in terms of crowd control. Obviously, the one we just tried supporting isn't working as well as it should. <laughs> so we're going to try something else. Please bear with us. We really do take your suggestions to heart. We really do try to incorporate and fix things. We are a volunteer organization. We don't have noodles and money to spend on things. But we try to fix them when we can, like I said, try to do. I can not quite believe the plan. Priest, is there anyone you need me to go kill? No. Clearly, you've watched Full Metal Jacket. Stand up, sir. Come on down, Private Snowball. Come on down, sir. No, no, don't sit down. Is that you? Ted, stand up. Sit down. I didn't say Simon said. Stand back up. Let's see how many times we can do this. Oh, there we go. Uncle Sam's misguided children. Okay, what I was saying was, we apologize. We are trying some new things in terms of crowd control. Obviously, it's not working this morning. We apologize. We do take your suggestions to heart. We do try to correct the problems that we find. Obviously, the one we have right now is not working. We are also having a, is anyone here from DHS? Next panel is DHS. And I can talk about them since they're not here. It's a DHS experiment. It's to find terrorists. So if the guy next to you is not sweating out in the hall, probably a terrorist. <laughs> Turn him in. I know that you're not sweating, Jim. Um, like Jim explained, we're going to do the uh, spot the lamer. So I'm going to walk amongst you and basically pick people out. Anybody you want. Get some females, though. I already warned them they may have their pictures taken. Oh, yeah. Uh, Chris is here. This is a more press friendly depth comment here. So you are a wanted fellow. We've been working undercover. Keep that in mind. They are walking freely and they can't get your photographs. about five or six. Just line up right here, please. Right out in front, where everybody can see you. Priest, you're doing a good job. I don't think we need to go any further. These guys look pretty lean. Yeah, guys, slide down right in the middle, please. Or we'll kill you. <laughs> Turn around and put your hands on the table, please. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, Priest, there are some more gals over here. More gals. That's good, priest. Thank you. You want to ask the first question? Nah? Okay, we're going to number you guys. Look at me. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, number one. The question is, where do you store your porn? <laughs> and you have to answer loudly. Lamer. <laughs> John. Do you often, which one? Uh, two. Do you often find yourself referring to anime characters as hot? <laughs> Use the microphone, guys. Not you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, number three. What does RBN stand for? Lamer. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not telling you. Trent. Number four. Have you ever had a lightsaber fight in public? Number three. Do you patch your neighbor's network computers to avoid malware infestation while you borrow their wireless bandwidth? <laughs> the answer was... So, do you love your uh, laptop more than you love your significant other? Do you love your laptop more than you love your significant other? Which, which number? Which number? Uh, no. Yeah. No? Yeah. <laughs> no. Mm. Alright, sorry. She just wants to answer. No. Okay. <laughs> number five. Pay attention here. Because <laughs> you could have done this when you were drunk and you might not remember. But that's not an excuse. Um, have, you ever, have you ever tried to get a picture with Jim Christie? Oh, <laughs> Look me in the eye. <laughs> <laughs> that she remembers, Jim. Do you remember? No, no I don't remember Not shit. That. <laughs> uh, number six. Okay, this is a hard one. How many episodes of Star Trek did Will Wheaton kiss a girl? I mean, Okay, we're going to vote. Who thinks number one is the lamer? Cheer, clap. Nobody. Okay. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number five. Number six. Number five. <laughs> Number six. Okay, number one, number four, and number five, and six can sit down. Okay, we've narrowed it down. All right, another round of questions. Number, now it's one and two, okay? One, do you have a three and a half inch floppy? <laughs> Sarah, where's Sarah? Oh, it, it, it. good. Number two, would you use an ATM at DEF CON? No. <laughs> Barry, use the mic. All right, uh, number one, what reading material do you keep in your bathroom? Reading material, magazines. Yeah, I'm here for it. 
very good. Trent, it's on, it's on the op-ed. Okay. Number two, would you prefer, prefer to go out with a hot chick or play World of Warcraft? Hot chick. <laughs> <laughs> Tom. Go <laughs> <Okay, okay. laughs> Number one, is your idea of a social event a land party? <laughs> All right. Number two, uh, name at least five Intel x86 machine instructions. That's enough. Next one. Uh, <laughs> Number one, have you ever purchased virtual gold or virtual weapons with real money? <laughs> <laughs> Last question, Chris. Uh, number two, for you to be up during the day, would you have to move to Tokyo? For you to be awake during the day, would you have to move to Tokyo? <laughs> Okay, this is the final vote. Number one. <laughs> I'm not sure I have to ask any more flipping questions. Number two. Okay, number one, you can have a seat. Number two, if you would come up here, please. We'd like to present you with the uh, coveted Spot the Lamer t-shirt. Says uh, feds, feds burn another one at DEFCON 18. I also have a coin for you. If you would walk in, all the feds have uh, swag for you. Badge. Thank you. Challenge coin patch. This is this is the coveted <laughs> National White Collar Crime Center pocket protector. <laughs> Newton, take your hands out of your pockets. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> we also we also have a vacation. Anybody else want to play some more contests? <laughs> okay, uh, this year we, we've uh, been allotted two tracks. So the first track uh, is to deal with uh, criminal cases and forensics and that kind of stuff. So we've got mostly law enforcement guys up here. Uh, at 1 o'clock we have another panel to talk about cyber strategies and policies. So if you'd come back at uh, 1 o'clock for that. Thanks, Priest. Sure, please. Thanks, Priest. Uh, we have armed all our uh, uh, panelists with our coveted bullshit flags. So if we think your question is bullshit, we're going to let you know. If uh, we think the, the uh, answers are bullshit, we're also going to wave our flag. So, you know, cheering is allowed. Uh, now we're going to just do a quick introduction, and then we're going to open it up to questions. And we've got a microphone down here uh, in the center aisle. The center aisle. This aisle. <laughs> okay, I'm Jim Christie from the Department of Defense Cyber Crime Center. Uh, was a special agent with Air Force Office Special Investigation for about 24 years. Uh, been a computer crime investigator the whole time. <laughs>